Jim, <laughs> I saw you coming in with this car. This is a pretty striking 71 Cutlass. Thank you. Yeah, and I don't know what it is about it. <laughs> it might be that it's screaming orange, I don't know. But wow, you've really, uh, you really did a nice, uh, you know, resto mod on this. What are, are you a Cutlass guy? Yes, actually, yeah. I've always owned owned some wheels. Yeah. So this was just one of those things. I've got a 72 that we bought brand new on our first winning anniversary. Oh, really? So oh, cool. we kept that. We found this one, and it was in real bad shape and decided, let's see what we can do with it. So, so this was the one you were going to play with, right? This was it, yeah. So how much did you pay for it originally? $500. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> that means it can't be in very good shape. There wasn't a lot of it there. So. <laughs> really? So what did you end up salvaging? Um, basically the frame, some of the body, uh, the, none of the fenders, none of the floorboards, none of the trunk. So that's all aftermarket so, yes. repops? Yes. Wow, you know, yes. it's great that that stuff's available and you can do yes. that now. Uh, Man. And but quality. I, but I do love the paint. That is that is a wild orange. What is that? Lamborghini orange. Oh, wow, Lambo orange. It's almost, a, it's almost like a green fleck in there. Is that? Yeah, a heavy, heavy flake in it, for sure. <laughs> Man. And then what's the contrast color? I mean, it, uh, this is pewter, GM pewter. And then the pinstripes are uh, thistle. It's a oh, Ford it's actually a purple, uh, isn't purple. it? Yeah. Oh, yeah, that looks good, yeah. Yeah, if you'd gone all that Lambo orange, I'm not sure it would have yeah. worked. It would have hurt the eyes. It <laughs> would have been screaming. But man, she's beautiful. I, I, I really love what you've done with it. And when you were coming in, I, I could see inside, and you've got a really interesting interior. This, You've got almost um, theater seating here. Yes. You know? <laughs> so your back seat could look over. And Is this for back seat drivers? Yeah, or? Yeah, yeah. So my wife can hit me in the ear. On. But, what, uh, what, are they, what are the seats? Uh, the seats are Camaro, Camaro bucket seats. Oh, all four of them? All four of them. Oh, that's interesting. That's why the back ones are up just a little bit higher because uh, we couldn't tear them all apart and make them set too low. So. No, I think it looks great. And then you had to uh, custom build that whole center console right. all the way back to the back, eh? Right. Yeah, that is, that is nice. Now, you know, your, your instrumentation looks like stock position, dolphin gauges, but kind of stock position, right? Yes, that, uh, that's the original bezel. Really? Uh, we uh, took the wood grain out of it and uh, just and painted it. So. So, it, so we get a contrasting color on the dash to match the exterior. Yeah, now you've even brought in a, a little bit of a darker gray. Is that true, or is that just the way the lights? Yes, there's darker gray in the uh, in the seats, inserts in the seats, and in the ceiling. Oh yeah, and the piping is nice. The orange piping is nice. Yes. Oh, it's it's just, great, and that you know that's a real subtle stripe, it is, and it is purple. But you've also cleaned the body up somehow. What did you? Uh, we took the drip rails off. I see. Just to give it a, a more smooth look on the yeah, exterior. It really comes around nice now. I like that. But otherwise, you really didn't hack on it too much, right? Oh, no. No, no. we don't want to. We don't want to. It's a beautiful <laughs> it's car. <laughs> <laughs> don't, don't make go, them. <laughs> don't go hacking on those. There you go. <laughs> yeah, she's, uh, she's beautiful. It's just striking. So uh, probably came with a 350 to begin with? Uh, yes, it did. You, uh, you still have the 350? No, we, know, we didn't get that with $500. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> what, 500 What do you expect? <laughs> yeah. Let's have a look. What okay. do you have under the hood? Yeah, that's no 350. Oh, what am I looking at? 455. It is an Olds engine. Uh -huh. Oldsmobile, Oldsmobile. 400 trans. I would, and frankly, I would expect nothing less from no. you. But what's all the man? You've really dressed it up. The uh, all the pulleys are March Performance. Uh, we did that with the came with the uh, the air cleaner as part of the an option on the, in a package, and an Edelbrock carburetor, and just a few little pieces of aluminum around. Man, but that that air cleaner. Yeah. That's worth the price of admission right there. I mean, yes. <laughs> that's beautiful. That is gorgeous. Yeah. We don't tell the wife what we paid for that. <laughs> <laughs> Honey, it's just really, really nice. Yeah, don't worry about it. <laughs> and uh, Cutlass? Uh, this we made up in a shop just to, uh, it's only on with Velcro, actually. It's covering a hole oh. where a latch used to be. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I like that. I like that a lot. That's pretty cool. Now, is this a car that you, you're driving? I mean, I saw you driving yes. it in. Yes. So I mean, you, built this for, you built this for driving and for fun, right? Yes. Man. She's just a beautiful car. And Thank now, you. Now, how far did you come? 20, 30 miles. Oh, so not far. It's not far. So you're aware of this show? You've been to it before? Oh, yes. Uh, almost every year. Oh, yeah? You yeah. like it? Yes. Well, we have a good time here. <laughs> and meet a lot of different people and see a lot of nice cars. Is there, there are a lot of different yeah. cars there, aren't there? And you get a lot of different ideas. You know, you start talking to somebody and say, hey, did you ever try that? Oh, yeah. No, I never did, you know? So. And sometimes it results in something like this. this. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man. Jim, this is a beautiful, beautiful cutlass, man. Thank you very nice much. Nice work. All right.